morning, everybody. It's uh, about 4 till 10, Tuesday. Um, I think it's the 11th of June. Huh, okay. I'm going to do Jasmina's tag. I know, it's crazy. All right, um, question number one is, how many times have you moved home in your life? Um, just once I moved back home. And I probably will never do that again. I'm too old. They're too old. It would just not work. It would, somebody would die. Question number two is, um, let's see. Do you feel that you are living in the past or the present? I would say the present because I have let go of so much stuff in my past um, doesn't mean that when it may come up in a conversation I have post-traumatic stress syndrome so I have tried to block a lot of stuff out a lot and um, people say yeah you never had it bad you know you got great parents you never had it bad and it's like kiss my ass okay Really? Uh, wake up. Wake up. Think about it. Look who you're talking to. You know? Don't get all pompous on me because I didn't have the ex exact same abuse as you. I'm serious. I have had people get pissed off and say I have no clue of what anything negative is. <laughs> or pain. Right. You know what I'd like to do with those people? If I could have a, a DVD of my life, I would make them watch it and say, now, okay, really, I don't know pain after a hundred and some broken bones, if not more, I don't know. I lost track. You know, I'm just rounding it off. Then, on top of that, having a dysfunctional family. Yes, it's real. I did. Okay. And then there's the BS of trying to fit into society. That's, that's, that's screwed up as well. That is why I am just like, I don't care. I don't care. I will do what I want to do. And I'm sick of tired of living in fear of what people are going to think or what they're going to, you know, say when they see me. Um, I, I'm sick of it. I am just so over it. You know, and it's just like, right? I usually have a hand gesture for that, but I, I'm not going to do it. But anyways, um, yeah, they do. They, they, they just think that everything is all hunky-dory peaches and flowers and happy bunnies. So, and I don't feel guilt. I don't feel guilt the fact that sometimes people will really get the wrong conceptions of others. So don't judge people until you know a little bit about their life story. And I don't tell a lot of people about my life story because that means I would have to think about it. I don't want to. It's done and it's over. And I got a, a middle age. I could have another 30 years oh my God, of this life. And um, it seems like eternity, but you know, it'll be like that and I'm going home. Yes. Um, if someone was able to, hold on. Oh, if someone were to serenade you uh, to win you over, what song would they sing? What song would they sing? I don't know. I think I'd be more impressed if. Um, Somebody played a musical instrument, like a violin or, or a saxophone or, you know, slapped a baby grand piano on, you know, my yard and did something cool like that. Yeah, that would do something for me. Yeah, I like classical music, so I think it would have to be like Ken and D minor is my favorite. So, anywho, number four is, do you have any plans for the future? In the future, of course I do. Um, I am not dead yet. I would like to pursue my photography stuff. Um, I would love to. Um, <laughs> actually, I, I would like to find someone who 
would be willing to work on like a kind of a commission thing and um, it would be just to basically submit stuff uh, my, my photography um, that would that would be you know maybe get some of this stuff sold um, which yeah I have no problem I have to watch for obvious reasons limits but ne never never have I ever gone over the limit as far as a yearly or monthly income for you know my benefits I've that's never happened um, contrary to popular belief shame on you um, no, it does, it does not work that way. There's a reason why they say starving artist, okay? Starving, no money, can't eat, you know? So, um, but I would like to do something with my photography. If anything, just as a hobby, um, a lot of things are, are very limited to me for um, obvious reasons. So, um, I was, I don't know, I, I, it's, it's a lot of work to submit all of these things to these websites. I mean, I would be here for like months at a time. And there are people that know exactly what they're doing and, um, you know, would know what and where to do, you know, put, put this stuff, so, and, and what to put, right? So, it's got to be a lot of trust there and, uh, uh, I'm just kind of hoping maybe somebody will see my stuff online and, you know, ask me about it um, and not, and then, you know, just do it that way. But I do need a website and I'm going to talk to my friend about doing this today and uh, see if she'd be willing to do it for a discount. Yeah, and I can get some of my stuff up there and make it look really schnazzy. So, okay. And question number four is, be honest, do you judge people who think differently to you? Um, no, I don't judge them. Usually I'm the one who's being judged. Um, actually, I think I have a lot of patience, um, considering uh, if somebody is going to jump on my butt to sit there and say, uh, you know, you're wrong, you're wrong, how dare you, you little child, you know, it, you know, it's like, I'm not going to sit here and argue with somebody that probably really has no idea what the hell they're talking about. Um, I'm not going to argue with somebody who is, um, who I have tried on several occasions to you know, explain to them, like, yeah, I'm sorry, but I don't feel that way, and that's not the way I live my life, you know, I'm sorry, but whatever, and it's usually over something stupid, and, um, that really shouldn't even matter, and therefore, um, if it doesn't stop, I cut them off, like that, no questions, they should know why, and, uh, that's something that really pisses me off, or pisses people off about me, is that I will just shut people off because if it's an ongoing argument, and it's continuous, and I shut them off, and they can't figure it out, then, um, wow, I would want to be hanging out with a bumblehead, you know, I mean, really, um, common sense, yeah, anyways, I'm gonna go, I love you guys, God bless you, be nice to each other, do not be rude, not assume and yeah watch who you judge because they can just come at you you know I'm just saying yeah I did I'm just saying I'm teasing I wouldn't do that to anybody but hey um is there anything going on this week I don't think so we're supposed to have storms tomorrow um I'm you know looking nice because I'm gonna go to the store here and probably about an hour and a half ish, maybe. I don't know. I just have to run up to the store real quick, like a bunny, and I will be home. And that's the rest of my week. Okay, peace be with you all. Love you. Bye bye.